Want to know how to get the best quality for your live streams? Stick around and I'll show you how to do it. Hey everybody, welcome back to Live Gaming Network. I'm GenX and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to maximize your video quality for your live streams. Most everybody thinks that streaming in 1080p is the best possible option for their bitrate. When in all reality, if you are not a partner for Twitch, then that is a bad option. Why is it good for partners? Well, because partners are given 8,000 kilobytes per second bitrate when they stream. Affiliates are only given 6,000, which means if you're trying to stream in 1080p at 60 frames per second when you're playing a game like Call of Duty or Fortnite where the screen's moving really fast, there's no way that your screen resolution to bitrate ratio can stabilize at that bitrate. It's just not possible. Streaming at 720p, 60 frames per second is the best option for affiliates, but I'm gonna show you guys one more option that is the best. If this video helps you out at all, do not forget to leave a comment in the comment section below, you guys. It may not seem like a big deal to you, but leaving a comment in my comment section below my videos helps my videos reach a larger audience, which helps me grow on YouTube. Also, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on. All right, let's show y'all how to do this. All right, the first thing that we're gonna do, you guys, is open up our OBS or your slobs and open up your settings. Once your settings screen is open, go ahead and click Output and make sure that you guys have your rate control set for CBR, that is a controlled bit rate. Now, I know we talked about having 6,000 as your max, but you guys have to leave room for your audio. Your audio also takes up bit rate when you stream, so you can't max this out at 6,000, otherwise you will pixelate because your audio will be kicking you up over 6,000. So you wanna make sure that you're well below 6,000, but above 5,000. So I like to hit mine at that sweet spot, 5055 kilobytes per second. All right, once you have your bitrate set properly, go ahead and select video. Your base canvas is going to be what your screen resolution is on your computer. My computer's on 1080, so I have it set at 1920, 1080. That will be your base canvas. If you do not know what your resolution of your computer is, all you have to do is right click on your main screen, go to display settings, scroll down, and it will show your display resolution right here. Now for your output scale, you guys, this is your magic number, your 1664 by 936. This isn't going to be an option for you guys to put in, so you're gonna have to click here and type it in yourself. 1664 by 936, and then click apply. This magic number right here, you guys, is divisible by the number eight, which is a perfect cubed number, which makes it perfect for your screen and for bit rate transferring. If you have a 1080 screen resolution, then there are actually pixels that are empty on your screen, but your computer still has to transfer that through the bitrate. So it's basically transferring information that your users never even see. Changing your resolution to 1664 by 936 makes it a perfect square, divisible by eight, which makes no pixels on your screen unused. It maximizes your screen resolution to bitrate ratio, which is exactly what you need in order to create a fluent, non-pixelated stream for your viewers. Once you're done, click apply and then okay. Well, that's it, you guys. It's not that big of a deal moving from 1080p to 936. It's super easy to do like I just showed you and I promise you it's gonna maximize your quality of your live streams. If this video helped you out at all, don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below, smash that like button, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Remember, don't be toxic, spread positivity. We'll see you next time.